We're only two minutes into our hike. We're hiking the Tunnel Mountains in Banff, Alberta, and look at the view. Oh, this is just... This is just two minutes in. Yeah, so it might get... Well, it, prob it will get better than this. So we took the gondola up and then we did the boardwalk. That was pretty busy with people and then we found this kind of hidden trail, like they don't advertise it with any signs. We're gonna try and hike to another peak. This sign says that it's the quiet side. Ooh, I like so that. Which trail takes you 1.6 kilometers to the steeply tilted strata of the small limestone peak to the southeast, offering sweeping views of the Sundance Valley. Flowers and wildlife found along the way are typical of Timberland. We're part way up and this is our view. What do you think? Awesome. It's awesome. We're very it's lucky. Right yeah, we are. It's chilly. We were joking and saying that this is like the 10 million tree view that we were supposed to get in New Brunswick when we um, hiked Mount Carlton, but I have a feeling this is a lot better. <laughs> so this is the town of Banff, eh? Mm -hmm. Surrounded by all of these mountains. Yeah. I think Banff is the sweetest town ever. It reminds me of Niagara Lake, but not really sweet, a lot bigger. Yeah. Julia's first candy apple, or caramel apple. Yeah, we went to Mountain Chocolates. Ready? Yeah. You like it? We just drove to Vermilion Lakes, but we missed the sunset. <laughs> we were shopping for crystals. <laughs> yeah, crystal shopping. Yep. <laughs> and we're planning on staying in Banff for just another night, and then we're gonna drive to... Lake Louise. Lake Louise. Yeah. Yeah, it's very nice. I think we were up there yesterday. Yeah, we think that this might be Sulphur Mountain. Yeah. Because we had a lot of rain today, and so it would make sense that there would be some snow. But, we don't really know. Final thoughts on Banff. I love it here, and I would like to move here. <laughs> <laughs> what about you, Jeff? I like it here too. You're like just surrounded by mountains. Every way. Yeah. You're just surrounded. Very nice town. I don't really know what you would do for a living here, like to make money. Mm -hmm. It's the only thing. It's like there's like the obvious, like work at a bar, like work in the tourism industry, which is fine, yeah. Mm -hmm. But and skiing. We we're like just ahead oh, yeah, of ski skiing, season. Skiing, yeah. We came here at what they call the shoulder season, so like just after people come in the summer for hiking and just before they arrive for skiing. So that's why we've gotten really lucky with like being able to get onto the gondola and we've heard that Lake Louise is not going to be that busy so um, it was a really good time to come and mm -hmm. we left it. Yeah. We are literally just driving to our campsite. I don't know what these are. Those are elk. We just made it to Lake Louise. What do you think of it? It's pretty cool. I think we should stay for a while. Yeah. And Come back see. when it's sunny too. Yeah. <laughs> We're just starting our hike. But look at this water. What? So it's the higher you go up, the bluer it gets. 
kind of looks like blue Kool-Aid. Yeah, it does. We snuck into this hotel. <laughs> it's a nice hotel. It is really nice. Every single time we go for a hike, mm. we are literally never, we've never been prepared once. Everyone around us has spikes on their shoes and poles. Backpacks with water, snacks, and we've got hats, mitts, cameras. That's it. We don't have water or spikes for our shoes or backpack. No like sandwiches with us or like granola bars. None of that. But we have this. Yeah, this is very pretty. It's eyes. definitely worth it. We're gonna keep going. Yeah. We're trying to get to Lake Agnes. It's getting slippery because the ground is icy. Yep, there's this snow. This part isn't that bad, but there's a lot of snow and ice. Yeah, I'm worried about going down. Yeah. But we'll see. We just saw the big beehive. Can't really see it because it's behind this tree, but that's the big beehive. Made it to Agnes Lake. It's a little bit frozen. How is the hike up? Well, sweaty. Yeah. This yeah. is where we came from. It is incredible. Like, we were, we hiked pretty high. Like, I'm pretty amazed by that. <laughs> like, we're impressive. No, like, seriously, though. Like, we, we just went up the whole time. Kept going up and up and up. Yeah. It's crazy. Now we have to go down. What's it taste like? Fresh water. Is it? Yeah. It's really cold. Does it taste like bad? No. Oh. It's good. Not needing this darn water as we drink it on the water. Oh. Goodbye, Lake Louise. Bye. Hiked up to Pater Lake. This is one of my favorite views so far. What do you say? Very nice, yeah. We uh, came here, we uh, arrived, and like there was another couple that also arrived at the same time as us, but we're the, we were the only people here. And there's, as you can see, these tracks are only from us. Like there was no one else mm -hmm. not here. So this snow, it's all fresh mm -hmm. in the lake. It's great because it's still, it's not frozen. And yeah. It's just beautiful. The drive is amazing. We'll have to record some of the drive because it's just like, it's like Christmas. It's yeah. Awesome. So. Love it. Made it to the Columbia Ice Field. All these mountains around us. Absolutely stunning. And there's Jeff. <laughs> Sun's coming out too. Now we're at the Athabasca Glacier. we got to capture this. We've just made it into Jasper National Park. Finally, we have found a sheep 
I've been looking for so long for a great so No, that's a goat actually. It's a goat. Buddy. Oh, you're right. It looks like that was a female bighorn sheep. As you can see right here. It's the female. The mountain goat, it's a little different looking. See, that was a female longhorn sheep. Pretty cool. Looks like we found some more sheep down there. They're huddled up. It's kind of hard to see. Wow. Wait, no, those don't look like sheep. Those kind of look like deer. Uh, mm, I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell from here. They look like deer, kind of. Yeah, they do. That's so cool. You can pass them then. I'll pass them. This is crazy. This is our second moose encounter in 10 minutes. <laughs> we have a mom and a little baby. We've just been watching them. It's so sweet. Looks like they're coming over here. Yeah. Hey guys. Yep. Just keep seeing more moose. Wow. Here's some more friends. <laughs> Just in the middle of the street. place is amazing. We just showed up to our campsite and we have some guests. Some more guests. We keep bugging them. Yeah, we don't want to bug them. Hi. Hey, Bonnie. How are you doing? I love how they just this is their home, so they're just walking around. This, this is gonna be. <laughs> He's the big dog. It's gonna be an interesting night. This is one heck of a hike. We got some friends up here. Mm -hmm. Sorry, buddy. You didn't mean to scare you. Here's another one. There's a couple. We're just gonna stay to the right. You can just kinda. Oh. oh. Okay. There's lots of them. Wow. There's some big males. The males are the ones with the big horns. There's a couple of them. So we're just finishing up our time in Alberta and we're ending in Jasper just finishing a hike that we did called the Old Point Hike and we kind of did it the backwards way so during the Black Diamond like difficult part we were going uphill but it was really good and we saw some longhorn sheep. Jeffrey just got his hair cut in Jasper and yeah, it's still on me. Yeah. I don't really... Well, I like it. Mm -hmm. It's short though. I like it. Okay. Good. And we're headed to the Kamloops. Are they in Alberta well, or... Cam Kamloops is the name of the city. Yeah. Kamloops. Is it in Alberta? No, it's in BC. It's in BC, so... I honestly cannot say enough good things about Alberta. This has been my favorite province that we visited. 
and I can't wait to come back. What about you, Jeff? Yeah. What did you like the most? Um, hmm. Probably Banff. Yeah. I really liked the town of Banff. Yeah. Um. Arriving in Banff, it just felt like, I don't know, like another world. You're just surrounded by mountains. We had such good weather. Lots of, uh, I, I like seeing all the animals in Jasper. It's like, yeah. between Banff and Jasper, it seems like the main difference is Jasper, ton of wildlife here. Like, so much. Mm -hmm. And then Banff wasn't as much. Um, Banff has really good hiking though. Really good hiking in Banff and really nice town there. Like the town is so nice. Yeah, they and Lake so Louise much. was just like, I don't know, out of a storybook. Yeah, I Lake wish. Louise was really pretty. Yeah, that I hike wish. we went on was good. Sorry. No, no, I was just gonna say I wish we had a little bit longer to stay there, and maybe we would have, like, if it was summertime, we would have had a little bit more to do, or if we weren't traveling in the van, we could have stayed at the Fairmont and then done some stuff there. But mm -hmm. the amazing. Fairmont, the Fairmont is both the Fairmonts in Bant and the Fairmont in Lake Louise. So nice. The one yeah. in Lake Louise, the windows, it's like right on the lake. It's yeah. amazing. Incredible.